are some things that make you feel kind of scared? Do you maybe get scared when you are out in your yard and you maybe see a snake? What about different kinds of creepy crawly bugs? In Oklahoma, sometimes we have scorpions that have a sting in their tail like this. They're not usually this big. What about other things that aren't animals? Do you get scared of the dark? Do you sometimes get scared of things you think you might see in the dark? <laughs> well, one time, Jesus' disciples, his friends, they got really scared. Let me tell you about that. It was a long day where Jesus had just taught the Sermon on the Mount, and everybody just wanted to rest and go to bed. But Jesus wanted to spend some time alone with God, so he told his friends, you go ahead and get in the boat and go on back over to the place that we're headed, and I'll follow afterwards. Well, his friends got in the boat. Everything was fine, and then a storm hit, and they started to get scared of the storm. They were praying and asking for help, and pretty soon, far across the water, they saw a little thing coming toward them, and as it got closer, they could tell it was a person walking on the water, and their first thought was, oh, it's a ghost! and they were extra scared. As it got closer, suddenly, they realized that this was Jesus. And Peter, one of Jesus' friends, he always did things, you know, he was always jumping to do things. And he says, Jesus, I'll walk to you. I'll come to you on the water. I'll walk on the water to you. And Jesus holds out his hand and says, come on. So Peter gets out of the boat and he steps his foot out on top of the water but it doesn't sink and he starts to walk to Jesus. And then the Bible tells us that he took his eyes off Jesus and started to sink. And then he got scared again. And he said, oh my goodness, Jesus, I'm sinking. And Jesus reached out his hand and said, trust me. And Peter did. And Jesus pulled him up and they walked on the water back to the boat together. And Jesus said to him, hey, don't take your eyes off me. Always trust that I'll be there for you. Whenever you start to feel afraid, reach right out to me. Reach your hand out and I'll be there for you. We can remember that too when lots of things scare us, like creepy crawlies and darkness. The minute we feel scared, we just reach out to Jesus and he'll be there. And he offers us comfort, his peace, his love, and hope that everything is going to be okay.